afternoon. Um, a lot of the guests who enjoy today's presentation, they all want to do it, but at 1 o'clock we'll be talking about who the heck Archduke Ferdinand was and why his assassination led to all of this chaos and war. Um, and then at 2.30, um, we also will be taking a look uh, at Dick Bennett's research talking more about uh, aviation during World War I and flying aces, so lots of good stuff. Uh, right now, however, it's my pleasure to introduce Jennifer Ruplett. Uh, Jennifer is a nonfiction writer from Delafield, Wisconsin. Her book, Alamo Doughboy, Marching in the Heart of Kaiser's Germany During World War I, uh, was published last year by Brandon Books of Boston. Um, it's available online at Barnes & Noble and Amazon.com, uh, but she's also brought uh, copies today that are available for 1895, and she'll be happy to sign you a copy um, after her presentation here today. Um, Jennifer is a married mother of two grown sons, has two cats, and hopes to add a beagle to the family later this year, um, but is uh, very interested in uh, joyous history and genealogy, and we're thrilled to have her here today. Jennifer. Thank you, Laura, and thank you to Midway Village Museum, this is a phenomenal uh, World War I reenactment, one of the largest in the Midwest. All the reenactors that do what you do, and also I wanted to thank Fitzgerald Funeral Home, who was a sponsor of the event this weekend. <coughs> Before I begin, I would like to ask are there any veterans here? So please raise your hand. I'd like to start out every single one of my talks by thanking and acknowledging the veterans, so thank you for your service. Find out and dig about as much as I could about World War I, in particular, 